The berry that I collaborate with, which is an apple, I kind of understood that it would like to comment on the energy, the ongoing energy of an old human art master. And then somehow I understood that this human art master should be William Turner. And then this work of his, Snowstorm, with a boat kind of in peril in heavy storm on the water. Uh, that became the painting that we would like to uh, use as a medium to allow, to connect Aronia, the berry that is an apple, with William Turner. Nine. One to four. Yeah, one to four. The reproduction that we will make using the colors of the berry, of its leaves and of its juice, um, we will use these uh, components to make a reproduction of this original painting. The energy that this reproduction will produce will be used to power a light that will highlight the original uh, Turner painting. And not only it will be inspired by this original, but it will convert light into electrical energy. So we will have a kind of biosolar painting. We will have a solar panel functioning, not for very long, but I think that that's the, the beauty of it as well. Uh, so it will be a very fragile, inefficient solar panel. We start from the juice of the berry and then you can start creating different types of blues and reds according to the pH, the acidity. Create different colors, um, that's one thing. And secondly, the scientists, the physicists with whom I collaborate, they found out that uh, the leaves, the juice that you extract from the leaves, the pigments therein, uh, can also convert light into electrical energy. So they also became kind of functional due to the, the wide range of color that the leaves of this plant produce. Suddenly our palette became much wider, so we can get a bit more close to, to the original palette that uh, William Turner used.